You're so cute. I could eat you. <laughs> <laughs> hey internet it's jessica and welcome back to yakuza we're gonna continue where we left off where uh, now the 10 billion dollar yen is uh connected to yumi and let's see more funny voice acting because again this has been absolutely hilarious <laughs> chapter six fatherhood i actually don't remember what happens in this chapter <laughs> there's a lot of cutscenes that are like that they're like super short and then it's like stop and now load into a loading screen <laughs> all right let me talk to reyna Haruka must have been very tired. She's sound asleep. Kazuma-chan, what are you going to do today? I got to go out and find some new leads. I'm going to go out of town. Are you going to be all right? You always get into trouble, Kazuma-chan. The dog. Glad the dog is still here. All right, let me take the elevator. Yes. Alright, hey Kazuma-san. What? My name is Moxa from Purgatory. I work for Kage. Do you have any spare time to meet with Kage? Apparently Kage's been having a family problems. He's all bent out of shape. And won't tell us a single thing. Kage has a family? He had a family a long time ago. His son grew up to be a punk. No different from the ones roaming these very streets. It's sad. The kid doesn't even know what his father looks like. Um, okay. Oh, I think I remember what this is. Hold on, I'm starting to remember. You got any sake on you? If you do, give it to me. Why should I give you any sake? What? You're not gonna give me any sake? Get lost then, shoo! The hell? Do I get money if I give him sake? Because I feel like he's not gonna give me any. Okay, speaking of items... I only used one, so maybe I'll be okay. I don't really know. Okay, I can't level up anything either, so let's just keep moving. What the hell's going on over here? Hey, my brother got a frost by eating from the ice cream you from your shop. Monica, it really hurts. You've got to be kidding me. Shut up and pay me 200,000 yen for my medical expenses. <laughs> for frostbite? From ice cream? I don't think that's how that works. Huh? What? You have something to say to an innocent customer? You again? Oh, you. Oh, this is the same guy! Stop bothering them. Huh. Well then, you'll be very sorry. Dude, I already beat you up for, like, starting a fight with a hamburger shop. What the hell? I like how this guy still has the same gimmick, trying to scam all the freaking restaurants around here. What an idiot. Alright, dumbasses. Oh, he's got a knife. Okay, you're first then. That guy's dead. You can't say that he's not dead. You're next. I just murdered a guy in cold blood. <sighs> I'll never come to this shop again, asshole. Good. Thank you very much. You saved our shop. Please take this as a token of our appreciation. Ooh, 50,000. Thank you. Thank you very much. Have some ice cream if you like. Alright, cool. Thank you. Oh. Eek! He just touched my butt! What? Wait a second. I didn't touch you. He molested me! This guy's a groper! Help! Somebody! Oh my god. Hey man, don't be touching my girl. I didn't touch her. Huh? You just touched her ass and now you think you can just walk away? Hey, I said I didn't touch- well, I suppose I'll just report you to the cops. Or maybe you can pay me 10,000 yen and I'll let it slide. There's no way I'm gonna pay you. What? All you're trying to do is extort some money off of me. <laughs> Look at the way that Kitty is posing right now. <laughs> what? You bastard! I wouldn't touch ass like that even if it- <laughs> Oh my god! 
So I take it you want to get your ass kicked. I can make that happen. Yeah, beat that chief to the bloody pulp. <laughs> is it is it because he doesn't want to, or is it because Kiryu is afraid of women? I don't know. <laughs> oh, we got a knife. Hold on. Oh, did I break the knife already? Oh. I like how this guy's name is Huge Dude. <laughs> how the hell did you get that strong? What's wrong? Is that all you got? I give up. Leave me alone, please. Just take this. Yeah, you dumb idiot. Wait! Looks like your faithful boyfriends ran away. Listen, why don't we cooperate and make some money? Think about it. Ha! Huh. How can you keep a straight face and say that to me? Huh? Well, you two then. Doesn't matter. I'll find someone else. Girl, get your hands off me. All right, let me get back to purgatory. It's going to be a long while before I can get over there, but I just will get back and see what they want. What the? You think I'm just some small time f you so you ignore me? I'm going to teach you a lesson. That's why I ignored you because you're an idiot. <laughs> God, here we go again. Look at this guy with the freaking. What? Please don't hurt me. How about if I give you this piece of gold? I guess I could sell that at the pawn shop, right? It's kind of random, but all right. I wonder if I can buy armor from this guy now. Let's see, sir. I want I want that armor. Where is it at? Fighting clothes. I got too much stuff? What? I have one space. Really? Does it take up like two spaces or something? That's a lame. Can I go into this store now? Am I allowed? Because technically I'm allowed to be here. Sir, I'm sorry, but you can't- Oh, what? What? That's lame. You should have given me authorization already. <laughs> Oh, I think I remember the storyline. I think I'm starting to remember what this is. Son. Kazuma, <laughs> how long have you been standing there? Pretty girl. She's got good taste in women. Kid you. <laughs> yeah, Besides the fact that she's the daughter of a crime boss. One of the families in this city? Yeah, some small time family from Osaka, sir. By the way, I don't have any new info. You're wasting your time here. I? Came to help you. Wait, what? Uh, okay. Are we not gonna say anything? The batting cage, huh? I guess I'll help Kage. I guess we'll go to the batting cages then. Ah, okay, so we're just gonna do it ourselves. It's interesting how he's willing to help people. I mean, no, I know for a fee, but no, he doesn't want anyone to help him. Oh, sir, sir, is that you? Huh? Who are you? It's, it's me. Oh, Tamora. Are you? Tamora? Yes. Oh, it's been so long. I thought you were dead. Huh. I guess I'm ashamed to say it, but I guess that's what everyone thinks. Who told you, Aoki? Yeah, he told me that you were trying to dig up some info on the, my case. And that you ended up in Tokyo Bay. <laughs> I'm amazed at Kage's work. What a perfect cover-up. What do you mean? To tell you the truth, about five years ago, I went to Purgatory to meet Kage. And if I realized that I had nowhere near as him, uh, him as an informant, so I decided to disappear so I could work under him. That's such a stupid reason! <laughs> Why did you fake your death? Well, you know, I don't have a wife or kids. I wasn't really missed. So, I thought it'd be easier to gather info if I didn't exist. So I asked Kage to do me a favor. I see, but ayoki has been looking for you ever since you disappeared. Really? But Kazuma-san, you can't tell Aoki. Please. Okay, I got it. See you later. What if I just tell him anyway? Because it's kind of f***ed up what you did. Like, if you want to work under him, you could have just told him, like, Oh, I'm getting a new job. Like, I'll, I'll see you later. That's so unnecessary to be like, yeah, I'm, I'm dead now. <laughs> Hello, if you want to see our boss, step into the toilet stall over there. You know, you're always welcome here. Oh, okay. Anyway, let's get going to the batting cages. 
I like how there is there is a weather system in this game. Maybe not like as like what I think it is, but still. What's going on at the batting cages? Huh? Oh, uh, some street gang looking guys have been looking for a guy and a girl. They said that they were heading for the batting cages? A guy and a girl? Yeah. They were talking about the guy ditching the gang. They were pretty pissed off. Yeah, the batting cage is some place. Uh, it's just some place. Why just yesterday there was some disturbance? Yeah, that was me and Majima. <laughs> that was me and Majima fighting. Are you heading to purga- are you heading for purgatory? If so, go to the public restroom that- You're welcome anytime. Oh, uh, again, that's another henchman of, um... Kage. Or the florist. It's, we're calling him Kage because we've been calling him the florist in um, the Japanese uh, version, so this is weird for me. Calling him that. Oh no, not again. Don't hang around here, you're an eyesore! What? I'm just walking through, sir! That's the best you've got! <laughs> what the f***? Kyoka, run! Okay! You alone? Wait. You got it all wrong. Shut the f up! Oh, kid. Tell the Oyubu I'll make his daughter happy. And you're not gonna stop me. Oh, this dumb kid. <laughs> I would not pick a fight with Kiryu. I, he's brave, though. You know, he's trying to defend his girl and everything, but still. What an idiot. Alright, sorry, kid. <laughs> Can I grab anything? Oh no. Hmm. Actually, can I not grab anything? Hang on. I don't think so. No. Oh! You know, he got me. He got one swing on me, so I'll give the kid that. <laughs> Split the money I got with you if you pretend this never happened. Settle down. I'm just passing by. What? So you're not from the Azobe family? No. Tell me. What are you up to? We're on the run, man. The Azobe family's after us. What happened here? Kyoka asked me to run away with her. I have to go get her right now. Where is she? At a club called Debra, in front of Theater Square. Can I get out of here now? Hell no. Uh oh. <laughs> Takashi, if you're gonna try to leave the gang, you gotta come talk to me face to face. Look at the way that these, I these guys I'd are walking. I text message for now, then later I. Bull. You were trying to break out. You've always been a Can we talk about this guy's we face over here? <laughs> out, I gotta go. Watch your mouth, son. What's your deal, old bastard? Whoa! Get out of here, Takashi. I did feel the urge to hit some balls today. <laughs> what well yours will have to do? What did you say? Huh? No. Oh, thank you. Old. It's too late to apologize. What? I, what am I apologizing for? Remember, you owe me one. <laughs> B King. Oh my god, I remember these guys. Hey, where's the bat I was carrying? <laughs> hold on, hold on. Hold on. I'm trying to get rid of these guys first. Alright, now it's just this dumbass. Oh! What? Alright, 
a dick. <laughs> what did he call me? I need the camera to turn around so I can see. Damn! Oh my god, he's actually good. I can't- I can't throw this asshole. That's interesting. Okay. Hold on. Wait a second. I don't have enough for that, but I have enough for soul. Enemies down! Finally, I have one of those! Finally! Yes! What the F is this guy doing? Come on, Kiryu. Oh my god. I can't even pick up the chairs. I would like to pick these up. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm getting my ass beat by this dumbass right now. This is so annoying! Kitty, stop! I'm like targeting him! Oh my god, bro. Where was the bat he was holding? Where was the bat? This is so stupid. Oh my god. I can't even block on time. Jesus Christ, what kind of fight was that? Son of a Hey. Leave Takashi alone. <laughs> He's already seriously People are looking for him all over the place. Why do they want him so bad? It's because of his girl. People saying she took her dad's loot. Her dad's? You mean the funds for the family? At a club called Deborah, in front of Theater Square. I gotta go to the what store and get freaking <laughs> freaking items. Get to Deborah. God, I can't believe you just kicked my ass like that. That still pisses me off. <laughs> I'll just buy like bentos. Usually bentos do good, but I don't know if it's like um the same in the original, so we'll see. It's still the same girl. <laughs> Club Deborah. Is it this one? This one, yeah. Oh my god, I remember this. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to fight those two idiots, right? If I remember yes. correctly. Huh? Who the fuck are you? Get out of my way. I'm never going back home again. Miss, I'm sorry, but I have to take you home no matter what. <laughs> he wasn't saying. even opening his mouth what when he was Takashi? speaking words. What are you going to do with Takashi? That kid that seduced you. Don't worry. We'll take care of him. No. You're wrong. He didn't have anything to do with it. I took the money all by myself. He didn't do anything. You're wrong, miss. He tricked you into stealing that money. Kyoka, move. I made up my mind a long time ago. I'll protect you with my life. Oh, oh this kid. Hold it, you little. You? 
Anaki, I'm sorry. This little it's getting a little little over here. Mind your own damn business. Get out of here. Not quite yet. You aren't gonna kill that kid. Shut your mouth. <laughs> Take your ass out of here. You wanna fing die? You got some set of balls. You know you're outnumbered. Get your hands off me. Let me go. This conversation's over. Kill him. Yes, yes sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> no hesitation. Just kill this guy. <laughs> oh. They all got their knives out, huh? Oh. Okay, hang on. Oh, that's some bullshit. Can't even get out. Hold on. I'm trying to pick up the weapon. Kid you, I hate it when he turns around like that. Come here. Are you kidding me right now? What? Jackass, get away from me. Oh my god, I hate the targeting in this game. Jesus. Like, you hold R1, like, it's just like the other Yakuza games, you hold it to who you're selecting, but it doesn't work half the time! It's so annoying! Oh my god! That didn't you- Come on, Kiryu! Yo! Oh my god, this game's pissing me off now. Get back, dumbass. Oh my god, I'm I'm losing my mind right now. This is so annoying. Come on. Oh my god, come on. Jesus. Jesus Christ alive! <laughs> Damn it. Takashi. Yeah? Don't be greedy. Leave the money. All right. No, it's not all right. How are we gonna survive? Let's get a job! What? You sorry little shit. You think you could just get up and run away with the boss's daughter? Tried to get out of a street gang by sending a text message. Pathetic. No. Shut up! Who cares? Takashi, let's get out of here. Miss, Oyabun wants you to be happy more than anything else. If that's the case, why didn't he come himself? Well, uh... Don't play games with me. It's like my whole life's been miserable. Because my dad's a Yakuza. We understand. Other people are wary of you. You've always been lonely. Your father has always felt bad about that. Takashi? I... Huh? I... I am a loser. But I'm gonna work hard and try my best to make Kyoka happy. That's bullsh- Why are we growling to this guy? You're not the dad. Then I'll prove it. Takashi! 
<laughs> Wait. You're not a Yakuza. All you have to do is promise to do everything you just said. Everything is settled, right? I have a message from Oyabun. Huh? Kyoka, I was born a criminal. Kyoka, I was born a criminal. I control dozens of henchmen, but I can't even make Oh, my own right, right, happy. the dad is here. I'm nothing but a two bit mobster. I know I haven't been a good father, and I don't deserve to hold you in my arms again. So you can go. Take good care of Kyoka. Looks like the boss was expecting this to happen. <laughs> and it's like Kiryu didn't need to intervene either. Seen enough? Yes. That monitor is such a piece of. I can't even see what's going on. <laughs> Sorry about that. I heard that you don't like the Yakuza. Yeah. You don't care? You're the father of the girl my son loves. That's all you are. That's quite a son you have. Only because I didn't raise him. <laughs> Same here. Better meet with Kage to see what's up. Oh, we're just here. Okay. Thank goodness, actually, I don't have to, like, run all the way across town. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. Tagashi's girlfriend's dad left this. Uh, Kyoka's father, huh? You're gonna give it to me? Yeah, we saw everything. He was touched by what you did. Well, he left it as a gift. You should take it. One more thing. There's a fighting ring and a small casino in this underground city. I made sure that you can access these facilities. Go check them out when you get time. Uh, Alright. See ya. <laughs> so wait, what did he give me? Oh. Hmm. Okay. Can I power up anything? I don't think so right now. Oh, hello? Hello? Sasuma-chan, it's Reina. Yeah, what's up? Date-san is so wasted. Can you come to Serena? Okay, I'm on my way. Please hurry. Oh no, another guy with freaking daughter issues. <laughs> so handy to have this like heat action now. Oh my god. Uh, help me! What the hell's going on? Hey you! You're the one that was flirting with me. In your dreams, don't talk to me! <laughs> Come on, baby. I'll be gentle. Ew. No. What? Hey, asshole. My chin's mine. You better watch your mouth. Take the girl. Why do I care? No, no. Kitty's gonna defend her. You better watch your mouth. <laughs> what? You think I'm scared of you? Get lost, you worthless drunk. I'm not interested in that skank anyway. I hate when people do that. When they get turned down, they just start insulting them. Like, you're the one who was being creepy. If you have the time, I know a good place to get a few drinks. Let me buy you a drink to thank you. Can't deny an invitation from such a cute lady. <laughs> Let's see what happens. This is a sub story. <laughs> I was trying to buy a drink. You know. Possibly say no to such a beautiful lady. Thank you. <laughs> We're gonna get robbed. I'm a regular at this place. I hope you like it too. She's got some big bahungas right now. I always end up falling for a guy when I get drunk. So I have to be careful not to meet the wrong people. But with you. <laughs> what is kitty? You look so, so awkward. <laughs> I like my men strong and muscular. You look pretty tough and wild. <laughs> I think there could be something between us. What do you think about me? You're cute. I could eat you. Oh, whoa. <laughs> if uh, you fall for me, you'll only get burned. I don't know. We just met. 
All right, I'm gonna I'm go all in. You're so cute. I could eat you. <laughs> really? I'm so embarrassed. Thank you. Oh my god. I may be young, but I know how to please a man. Wanna find out how? We're gonna get drugged. <laughs> I, I know it. Don't hold back. Here's to a dirty night for the two of us. Cheers. I don't feel like drinking right now. No, I want to see what happens. I, I want to see. I want to see. Cheers. Yeah, she didn't even drink. See that? Wow. You're so strong. I wonder what you're like in bed. <laughs> you know, lately I've been having a streak of bad luck. I have no luck with men, but I feel that will end today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't get over Kitty's face right now. <laughs> I just want to drink the night away. Will you stay with me for a while, please? Okay, I'll drink to that. <laughs> Cheers. Yep, she's still not drinking. Sexy. I'm so drunk already. <sighs> huh? What's wrong? Are you all right, sir? That bartender's a little too large. Not that I'm trying to discriminate, but like, hey, he's gonna bug me. <laughs> hey, wake up! Are you all right? You just got conned. Yeah. That girl works for the bar. They just ripped you off. It's a common thing in these parts. <laughs> I bet you learned your lesson. <laughs> <laughs> How much did I lose? Did I lose anything? It doesn't look like it. Hold on. Which bar is it? Oh no, she's right here. Uh, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I had no choice. Um, the bar is open right now. If you want your money back, now is the best time. Uh, bye bye. Ah, welcome. You had a little too much to drink last time. <laughs> Were you able to make it home all right? I'm here to get my money. I came back. To get my money. I don't believe we got any of your money. Last time you were in here, you bought a couple of drinks. That's about it. If you have a problem with our service, just get the f out and don't ever show your face in here again. What a voice change. Bring that shit. <laughs> All right, bar staff, huh? Damn, what the hell is this guy wearing? Pajamas? Can you turn around? What the hell are you doing, dude? Wait, wasn't that the guy who warned me outside? Ow! Don't let that mother get away! Okay. Dumbass. I, I got it. You won. Cut me some slack, please. You're all talk. Yeah, give me my money back, asshole. Yes, this is for your trouble. Please forgive us. Take this. I just want my money back. I gotta go buy it like okay. items. We'll just excuse ourselves now. We're very sorry for all the trouble. Wait, why was there an option to refuse? I, yeah, I got my money back. God damn. They took a hundred thousand yen off of me. Oh, my body might as well. Alright, can I finally go to the drugstore, please? Finally, made it back. 
Oh, Dante. Hang on. Let me heal myself before I talk to you. Oh, never mind. Because <laughs> of a chance, I'm glad you're back. Detective Dante's not alright. Yeah, we can see that, girl. This is some pretty strong stuff. What's he trying to escape from? I have no idea. I think he's going through a lot. Incoming call, Saya. I'm sick of you always standing me up, asshole! What was that? Call from a girl named Saya. Detective Date, I think he blew her off. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's his daughter. He mentioned her while he was drunk. I think he promised to meet her somewhere around here. Oh, that's too bad. Around here? Yeah, across from here. There's a back alley. In the alley, there's a small park. Park number three. Oh, Date. I think this this mission specifically uh, is the one where Date really feels like Kiryu is like his friend. Because, you know, he they've been friends for a really long time. They've become best friends, so I'm pretty sure this is where it starts. Where are we going? Mister, where have you been? Why didn't you wake me up when you went out? Yeah, I'm sorry. I still have some things to take care of. Will you wait for me here? Yeah, that's fine. See you later. <laughs> Alright, let's go deal with Date's daughter. Hey, mister! You wanna have some fun with us? Ew, girl, you you're in afraid? high school. We'll do whatever you want, except no rough stuff, okay? What are you saying? Come on! You know. Uh, sorry. Uh, forget about it. But what are we gonna do, Saya? We'll find something. Come on. Saya? Hey! You're Detective Date's daughter. So, does your father know what you're doing? What? Of course not! Are you f <laughs> I'm not as stupid as you. I wouldn't sell myself to strange men for a chunk of change. You think you can judge me? If you want to rat on me, go ahead. I need money any way I can get it. Girl, Piss this off. ain't the way. Get Sorry. a job or something. Mister, are you Saya's on Saya's side? Probably. I see. Between us, Saya's been getting involved with some a strange guy. Some guy named Shataro. He works for a bar called Shellic in the Champion District. Go on. She says she has exp expensive tastes. And she's trying to earn money for him. Listen, I think she might be in danger. You look tough and you're Saya's dad's friend, right? Can't you do something to help her? Yeah, I, I guess I gotta do it because Dante's drunk as hell. What's the matter? Well, I'm the owner of this place, caf of this cafe here, and we've been having a problem. Someone is spray painting the storefront every time I race it. The bastard just spray painted again. I wonder if there's any way to prevent it from happening. Oh. Got an idea. Why don't you stand out here a while and keep an eye on it? You look tough. Maybe you'll scare him off. I bet I can catch the guys that have been writing this graffiti. You'll be rewarded, of course. So how about it? Yeah, you know what? I need money right now. Sure. Then stand guard right here. Okay. Really? Damn. Hey, are you the one who did this? No. <laughs> Where'd that guy go? Who the hell are you? That guy just ran out for no reason. Shut the fuck up. Are you trying to f the Yakuza? You got a shitty attitude. I'm gonna fuck you up. Okay. Listen, I'm getting paid. It's fine. I'll do some sub stories. Eek! Why have you been doing this? Are you the one calling the shots? The, the cafe refused to pay us, that's why we did it, for punishment! Besides, this kid's the owner's son! Shut up! That's none of your business! Alright, I really want to be a designer, but my father never listens to me. He always telling me that I have to take over the family business. That's why I wanted to piss him off. I I'm sorry. Dude, stand up for yourself! I'll never tag a shop again. Alright, dick. 
Where's the old man that was over here? I see. Yeah, I heard from the culprit himself. It was my son all along. Maybe I was being too hard on him. Even though it's graffiti, the design itself's not bad. I guess he may have some talent after all. I'm gonna have to try and listen to my son more often. Here's a reward, I promise. Thanks for everything. Oh! Uh, yeah, okay, thank you. Bro, can I just walk in Kamurocho with a fighting an idiot? You look like you know how to fight. When you drink, when you drink alcohol, you get heated and beat the fools. You, can, you can't cure hiccups though. Uh, but if you walk around the streets while drunk, you tend to get picked on. Okay. <laughs> shellac. So is this shellac? Which one did I enter? This one? Are you shellac? Is Shotaro here? Are you an acquaintance? Yeah, we're friends. Really. Are you gonna order something? Well, I'll give you a little quiz. Try to guess which drink here is the most expensive. Forty years. Hmm. It's probably obvious, isn't it? The Baumar of 40 years? That was an easy question. I gave you that one. It's pretty premium liquor. There may be only one bottle in this entire city. I've never even had it before. I like you. I'll tell you about Shotaro. Shotaro doesn't work here anymore. He's quit about three months ago and started working at the host club Stardust. He said he wanted to become the number one host in this town. He goes by the name Shota there. Oh god. Oh my god, Shota's the idiot that told that guy he can only have the ugly girls in the last video, remember? Now I know who this idiot is. Oh, kazuma san what's up? Um, I'm looking for Shota? Yeah, Shota is... They're over there. Huh? Hey, wait, uh -oh. mister! Detective. Saya. What? Dad. Excuse me, sir. I'm sorry, but move. <laughs> Shota, oh. are you okay? Saya, what are you doing in a place like this? What am I doing here? What? You're trying to act like a father now? You stood me up today, remember? But I... You always do that. And even when we do meet, you stare off into space and act like you're bored. And then you just up and decide to try and be all fatherly? Saya. I'm leaving. Saya. Sadra, you need to stop feeling sorry for yourself and step up. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Get the f out of here. Get your hands off her. Huh? This hoe right here owes our company some cash. So mind your own business and f off. His oh, voice. Money. That's right. She's been spending a lot of time in the host bar and now she's deep in debt. Since <laughs> ain't no way she can Goofy match, deep in debt. To make some money. We're gonna make her a movie star. If you're interested, pick up a copy. Why are you talking Ow. like that? You punch this f***ing idiot. <laughs> Dad! Did you hear his voice squeak? Kazuma. That's alright. Why? why are you here? Why am I hey. here? You just saw me! I hope you're ready to get your ass kicked. Date. We'll talk later. I hope you're ready to get your ass kicked. <laughs> I can't. I can't get over the voice. <laughs> Oh my god, here we go again. Alright, dumbasses. Oh, that guy has a taser! Hang on. Idiot. So glad I have this heat action now, like seriously. Hang on, hang on. Ow! Get out of the damn way, I'm trying to pick up the taser. Mr. Deep and Dead over here, Goofy. Guess it's you. So 
worry, Dante, I got this. Hey, I'm her father. I want to talk to your boss. Detective Dante is taking a long time. He went alone. I wonder if he's okay. Of course I'm gonna have to check. It's my my job. <laughs> Kazuma-san. <laughs> Why is Kitty walking like that? Shota, he told me he owes a lot of money to some loan sharks. He has to pay them off. Akiyama. <laughs> How long have you been doing this? It it was my first time. But if we can't come up with the money by next week, Shota said they're going to kill him. He tricked his own girl out just to save his own ass. If he really loved you, that'd be the last thing he'd ask you. But that's true. I can't live without Shota. Girl, you need to find a better Father man. Would do anything to protect you, no matter what it costs him. The one who truly loves you isn't Shota. It's your father. Kazuma-san? Actually, I am worried about my dad. Do you know where the loan sharks are, Saya? In the Hanagata building on Pink Street. They have an office over there. It's always Pink All right, Street. Come on. You're coming with me. <laughs> you listen, old geezer. If you're Saya's father, why don't you pay off her debt? And we'll forget about making that porn video. How... how much? For the bar debt, 200,000 yen. Add some interest to that. Let's call it an even 4 million. <laughs> Bruh. Shota borrowed money from an associate of ours. That's why the interest is so high. Oh, man. If you can't pay us, then we'll just have to have a little talk with Saya. Huh. Uh. Shota, you okay? <laughs> the you piece of sh Oh, Dante. This asshole's a pig. Huh. Section 4. He's in the organized crime unit. For real? This is bad, man. Chill out. Hey, old man. Since you're in Section 4, you probably have access to a lot of guns, right? What? If you run some of those hot pieces over to us, I'll forget about Saya's debt. How about it? We got a deal? No deal. Go fuck yourself. Stop trying to act so tough. Shota, why? Because he's a. You're a deadbeat dad. You couldn't give two s about your daughter. Could you? Fuck you. Stupid. You lay even one finger on her. I'll kill you. Then I guess that seals the deal. I'm. Saya's father. And. A good cop. There's no way in hell I'd accept your offer. So you're saying you don't care what happens to Saya, right? Your job takes precedence over your daughter? Kill me. Excuse me? I said kill me. If I die here, the police won't stop hunting you. You'll be f The Japanese police aren't as soft as you think. Plus, in this Saya's game, though. <laughs> I don't know about that. Good care of her. Well, if you insist, you know, we really aren't afraid of any f pigs. We had nothing to lose, you That guy was scared, asshole. though. <laughs> Dad! Who the f are you? Your worst Mother nightmare. So, you've been working side by side all this time. You're a bunch of pussies. All of you. Alright. Oh. Not so tough right. now, huh? Oh, okay, okay. Not so tough now, huh? huh? You're not tough either, you dumb. You got a knife. Idiot! Oh, 
Okay. He wants to play dirty, huh? Get out of here. Umbrella holder, sure, yeah. Oh, come on, kid, you. You want a piece of me, old man? This isn't happening. Turn around! I hate when he does this. Jesus Christ. Oh. Oh. From 200,000 to 4 million? I assume that's a joke, but I'm not laughing. <laughs> no. Show me the papers. I owe you one, Kazuma. Forget about it. You're good. We're friends. Dad. You look like any other high school girl now. Ooh, don't say things like that. Yeah, that was kind of weird, kid. You just, just don't say anything. Dad. <laughs> oh. Saya. I'm a horrible father. I ran away from you and your mother ten years ago. So, I know I don't have the right to preach to you. But still, I want you to promise me one thing. Have a little more respect for yourself. Saya, you're a good girl. You just need to believe it. Nevertheless, when you're in trouble, or if you're in danger, I'll be there for you. You can count on me. Always. Okay. I promise. Please don't cry. Kazuma. No, it's okay. You have a moment with your daughter. It's all right. We'll, we'll talk later. Good morning, Detective Date. Chief, what's wrong? Yeah, we need to talk. Commissioner, you wanted to please. speak to me? Ten years ago, you disobeyed orders and continued to investigate a case we closed. This led to the demotion to your current position. I certainly hope you wouldn't make the same mistake twice. Well, no. Let me cut to the chase. I'm pulling you off the case as of right now. Which case exactly? Don't bullshit me. Date, you're off the case. You're dismissed. I've got to go. This hey, man's always getting Date. like bad luck. That's Detective Date? Yes. What do you think, Sudo? That Yakuza, he's working with Detective Date? Correct. I can't say who, but we've been asked to investigate. This is an order straight from the top. Can you have Homicide take care of it? No problem. I remember this guy. Wasn't he in like two of the games, right? All right, we're going to end it there. This was a long chapter, but it's mainly because I was doing some stories too, because I like doing them. Um, they, they've been so much fun. But the voice acting is hilarious in this part. Oh my god, that guy who was attacking Saya, Mr. Goofy. Oh, Jesus, that was great. Anyway, <laughs> so... Um, yeah, I think that guy was in Yakuza 2 as well with the whole thing with Kaoru. I'm pretty sure she was like his... She was like uh, un working under him or something like that. I can't remember, but I feel like I've seen this guy more than once than just the first game. But anyway, hey, uh, now we got that out of the way. Uh, Dante's fired, so we're gonna see how the rest of this story goes in the English dub. But with that being said, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Yakuza, yeah, remember to leave a like. Please let me know in the comments what you think, and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you guys know when I upload the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye!